this time on the Moby Duck. We've been looking around for about two hours now. And uh, just the only problem is there's about 100 sea lions and they're pissed. If they want to get crazy, we can get crazy. I'd be lying to you, but I told you I wasn't a little nervous on this one. Look at the boat though. Freaking loaded. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, subscribe. Also guys, fucking like these videos. Get serious, dude. It helps get them out there and whatnot. We got a big day ahead of us. We're heading up to the islands for a nurture opener. Never been up there before. I heard it's real scary. There's fucking sea lions. <laughs> and cliffs and whatever. Scary stuff you don't want to be seeing down there. We got the boat loaded up. We got Jesse dancing. He's uh, he's gonna be another diver today. We got two divers and then my dad wanted to come up, come along with us. So uh, yeah, we got about an hour and a half trip. So let's get to it. Let's get to work, guys. Woo. Just got up here to the islands. Here they are. See some seals over there, I think, maybe. I don't know. We got a new camera, though. We're gonna test her out. Should be a lot better. We got a little flat screen TV. Yeah, we know what we're doing now, Jess. <laughs> yeah. Moving up. Oh, yeah. We're figuring it all out. We're gonna drop down there and... That's a pretty good angle, huh? Maybe a little more. Yeah? Yeah. Huh. Hey, I'm gonna go up just a little bit because we did drift back just a hair. All right. Okay. So yeah, we're centering her down. Just make sure it doesn't bounce off the ground. Okay. Another camera's heavy. Yeah, we have that big weight on that one. Oh, see the bottom. Yeah. Oh yeah. Sandy. It's kind of sandy. Yeah, that's not... Not what we're looking for. No. The change is pretty quick, though. All right, round two. How deep is it? About 51 feet. Okay. Okay, here's bottom. That's pebbly. Oh, yeah. We're looking pebbly now. Uh, what happened? We went to black and white? <laughs> yeah. It's that uh, jet interference or something. I don't know. Yeah, they're jamming us. I really don't know. <laughs> We've been looking around for about two yeah, hours we're now. We're here, Jason. And, uh, oh, yeah, they're there. Oh, Just, yeah. They're protected by sea lions. Oh, yeah, that's the first time we've... That's oh, the most fuck. we've seen so far. Yeah, that's all we need to see. Just the only problem is there's about <laughs> 100 sea lion, and they're pissed. You just don't think about them. Yeah. It's called Sea Lion Rock. I wonder why. This is where the, I guess this is where the sea urchins are at, though. He's going in! <laughs> Pissed off all the seals, so uh, or the sea lions, so we're moving spots. We're gonna check over here. What was that? Is that an octopus? Where the hell are the urchins at? I haven't even seen one of them. Found another spot Perfect. out here. Uh, so last case scenario, we'll go dive over there at the seal to rock because that place looked loaded. You can hear them from over here. <laughs> They're so loud. They're at least a mile, over a mile that way, and you can still hear them. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna hop down and see if we can't get a bag or something. I actually landed on a really good spot. This is probably the most urchins I've seen. But the problem is 
a lot of these guys are just too big. You have to be between three and a half and five inches, and they're way over that. I asked for a bag line. My deckhand tied the bag off to the my umbilical, so I'm pulling the bag line back to me so I can grab the float bag and float this big old bag back up. I'm using the air coming out of my aga to help fill this float bag. Once it gets a little bit in there, it'll start lifting off the ground. And it doesn't really take much. Might as well use that air too to help float it. But air expands as it's coming up, so it doesn't really take much. Once she takes off, boy, she takes off. Uh. came up from my dive and filled up almost pretty much four cans right there. We're about uh, the same dancing down right now. Yeah, looking pretty good so far. Finding them, we landed on a pretty good spot. We only had one sea lion come up to us so far, so ain't nobody bothering us now. I think our goal today is, I want to say at least 1,500 pounds. 1,500 pounds is the goal. Yeah, it sounds like he wants to come up. He's getting a little cold. Yeah, being out here diving all the time, it gets freaking, it gets, it gets real chilly down there if you're not used to it. All right, dance is coming up. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All the cans are full, seven cans, and then uh, half a bag. So yeah. Oh yeah, we're getting pounds on the boat. This morning looked a little weird. Ain't gonna lie to you, it took us all morning to find them. It's getting a little weird. But we're on them. We're gonna, uh, I think we kind of cleared this place out though, so we're gonna move ahead. There's some boats over there. So uh, yeah, it's really hard to move around right here too. It's the, the rocks and big old barnacles we get hung up on everything. So we're gonna see if the terrain's a little bit better over there by where those guys are at. So yeah, we're gonna head over there and uh, I'm gonna hop back down there and see if I can't fill this deck up. <laughs> on this dive, I was a little hesitant to jump in because the current started picking up. And up in the islands, once the current starts picking up, it gets smoking. Yeah, I hopped down there, hit the bottom, started running around, got what I could. But eventually, yeah, the current started picking up so quick. I started fearing for my life. Not really, but I needed to work my way back to the boat and get up and uh, try to move spots. I didn't know how fast this current was going to go, so yeah, it gets kind of scary. 
current starting to rip everywhere, so we found a little bit of shelter right here. It's like a river over there. Yeah. You can see like all around it. Turns for good. Okay. I see some sea lions down there. Not a big deal. I got my knife. If they want to get crazy, we can get crazy. I'd be lying to you if I, <laughs> I told you I wasn't a little nervous on this one. Like 10 feet from rocks. All right, I'm getting down there. As soon as I jumped in, literally got all wrapped up in this kelp. This stuff is super strong and it goes all the way down to the bottom and it's attached to rocks and you can't pull them off. Luckily I brought that knife, sliced right through it. Not a problem. Came up from my dive. The uh, only ran into two seals down. There's two sea lions down there. I figured there was there was like a dozen hovering around before I went down, but they didn't want to mess with me. They knew they knew I was packing, so they just don't. They don't want that smoke. Sun's coming down. We're about to head in. Sun up to sun down. That's how we do it. All right. Look at the boat though. Freaking loaded. Seven cans and what, five bags. Yeah. You good there, Jess? A great yeah. day. What about you? You have fun? Great day. Hell <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. You have fun, Dad? Yeah. Good time. <laughs> All right. Always a good time. Hell yeah. All right, guys. We're going to head in. Looks like it's a smooth, should be a smooth ride. See you guys at the dock. We're going to do a little pit stop. We got a couple crab pots sitting out here. We're going to see if there's any crab in them. We haven't checked in a while. Well, that sucks. Yeah. Oh, the Lord. After three hours of waiting at the dock to unload, we're finally unloading. Green guys up there, unloading all these bad boys. You guys take a guess in the comments how many pounds you think we got. I'm guessing around a thousand pounds. I think we got a thousand pounds. Alright, come up below, get your, get your guess going.
finally just finished weighing out. It's about nine o'clock. We started at like five in the morning, so I'm freaking beat, dude. It's been a long day. But uh, we ended up with 974 pounds. So that's the best day yet. We've been out here three or four times now, and that's the best day. I mean, half the day we sp spent looking for him. I wasn't sure what was gonna go on. Wasn't looking real good. Look, look, it was almost looking like a wasted trip up there. But uh, yeah, ended up panning out and it was good. But uh, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you uh, hit that like button.